like somebody's playing with a drill inside my skull. You sure this is the place? It's the address in the report. Right. Okay. Let's get going. Sexiest androids in town. Now I know why you insisted on coming here. Oh boy. Welcome to Eden Club. Lieutenant Anderson and his plastic pet. The fuck are you two doing here? We've been assigned all cases involving androids. Oh, yeah? Like wasting your time. There's some pervert who, uh, <laughs> got more action than he could handle. <laughs> we'll have a look anyway, if you don't mind. <laughs> Come on, let's go. It's, uh, starting to stink of booze in here. You're so disgusting. I think I'm gonna puke again. die of a heart attack. He was strangled. Yeah, I saw the bruising on the neck. That'd prove anything, though. Could have been a rough play. The only way to access its memory is to reactivate it. Think you can do it? It's badly damaged. If I can, it'll only be for a minute, maybe less. I just hope it's long enough to learn something. if it wasn't you. I, I don't know. I wasn't shut down. I... I didn't see anything. Were you alone in the room? Was there anyone else with you? He wanted us to play with two girls. That's what he said. There was two of us. So it was the other android that strangled him. Is that it? So there was another android. This happened over an hour ago. It's probably long gone. No. It couldn't go outside dressed like that unnoticed. 
It might still be here. Think you could find a deviant among all the other androids in this place? Deviants aren't easily detected. Oh, shit. There's gotta be some other way. Maybe an eyewitness, somebody who saw it leaving the room. I'm gonna go ask the manager a few questions about what he saw. You let me know if you think of anything. Did you know the victim? No, I mean, he came in maybe two, three times. I mean, these guys, they don't really talk very much, you know? Come in, do their business, and then go on their way. Excuse me, Lieutenant. Can you come here a second? Found something? Maybe. Can you rent this, Tracy? For fuck's sake, Connor. We got better things to do. Please, Lieutenant. Just trust me. Expense account. Purchase confirmed. Eden Club wishes you a pleasant experience. You're welcome. Delighted to meet you. Follow me. I'll take you to your room. Okay, now what? Saw something. What are you talking about? Saw what? The deviant leave the room. A blue haired Tracy. Club policy is to wipe the android's memory every two hours. We only have a few minutes if we want to find another witness. Uh. Hey, let's try this one. This better be worth it. It saw the blue-haired Tracy. I know which way it went. Then go for it. There are androids everywhere. How are you gonna tell which one saw the Tracy with blue hair? I know which direction it took. I just need to find another android on its path. It didn't see anything. I made a mistake somewhere. This has got to be the most expensive investigation of my career. track again.
We didn't see anything. I made a mistake somewhere. Take it from here. Look at them. They get used till they break and then they get tossed out.
And that man broke the other Tracy. I knew I was next. I was so scared. I begged him to stop, but he wouldn't. And so I put my hands around his throat and I squeezed until he stopped moving. I didn't mean to kill him. I just wanted to stay alive, get back to the one I love. I wanted her to hold me in her arms again, make me forget about the humans, their smell of sweat, and their dirty words. Come on, let's go. Probably better this way. Lako had a car. I wouldn't want Alice out walking in this cold. I saw it once in the garage. I don't know if Zako even ever used it. These people we're going to see. How do you know about them? Overheard androids Zako captured. They said they were humans helping androids across the border. What if it was a lie? Or just another trap? All I know is those androids believed it. Until Slako killed them. Is it much farther? We should arrive in an hour or so. Malfunction detected. Emergency brakes activated. This doesn't look good. Stay inside, Alice. Alice won't make it. We have to find somewhere to spend the night. There's nowhere we can stay around here, Carol. Over there. Find shelter. We have to get out of the cold. Looks like it's been abandoned for a while.
place is falling apart. It's not gonna be easy to find shelter. Here we go. I don't think we'll find anything better. Let's settle in for the night. I'll get a fire going. I'll make the fire here. That way we won't be smoked out. Alice? in memory. I should have one for you. This is a story about a princess who... No, not a story like that. Make one up for me. This is a story about a little girl who was tired of being afraid. She dreamed of being like all the other little girls, but deep down, she knew she couldn't. Then, she met a robot, who wasn't very happy either, so they decided to run away together, to try to find a better life. They encountered great dangers along the way, but... But 
they stuck together. So they overcame all of them. Along the way, they met a gentle giant who promised to protect them. How does the story end? They reach the place they dream of and live happily ever after. Stories always have happy endings, but real life isn't like that. Time to sleep. We have another long day ahead of us tomorrow. Are you going to come say good night, Luther? Yes. Yes, of course. brave. It's still snowing. We have a long walk tomorrow. We better leave early if we want to avoid being seen. Do you remember anything from your life before his laptop? No. My model was designed to carry heavy loads. I might have been a longshoreman or a laborer. Who I was doesn't matter anymore. It wasn't really me. Kara, have you ever noticed anything about Alice? No. What do you mean? Jerry, we were working here before the park closed. We didn't mean to frighten you, but sometimes humans come to hurt us, so we wanted to see who was there. What are you doing here? We were looking for shelter for the night. We'll be gone tomorrow. A little girl. We haven't seen one for a long time. Children used to love to come and see us. She looks sad. The last few days have been difficult. We have something to show her. Something fun. She'll love it. Does she want to see? Oh, I don't think she's in... Well, she should follow us, then. Alice, I don't know if it's a good Come idea. On, Kara. I don't think you have any choice. Our guest. The little one can climb on board. The carousel is about to begin.
first time I've seen her smile. She hasn't had much to smile about lately.